We want to solve the given equations. Looking at the equation on the left, the solution is a value of x that satisfies the equation or makes the equation true. The first step in solving the equation is to simplify both sides of the equation. Notice how we have like terms on the left side as well as the right side. On the left, 9x and negative 8x are like terms. On the right, 10 and 1 are also like terms. Simplifying on the left, 9x minus 8x is 1x or just x, and therefore the left side simplifies to x plus 3. On the right side, 10 plus 1 is equal to 11. And now to solve for x, we need to isolate x on one side of the equation. Notice right now we have x plus 3 on the left. In order to undo the plus 3, we perform the opposite operation to both sides of the equation, which means the next step is to subtract 3 on both sides. And now simplifying on the left, we have x, and then 3 minus 3 is 0, which is why we subtracted 3 on both sides. We have x equals, on the right, 11 minus 3 is equal to 8. The solution to the equation is x equals 8. Which means if we substitute 8 for x back into the original equation, it will satisfy the equation, meaning the left side of the equation will equal the right side. And let's go ahead and check this. Substituting 8 for x, 9x becomes 9 times 8. And then we have plus 3 minus 8x becomes minus 8 times 8. And this equals 10 plus 1. Now let's evaluate the left side of the equation on the calculator. We enter 9 times 8 plus 3 minus 8 times 8. Enter. The left side of the equation simplifies to 11. Equals on the right side, 10 plus 1 is also equal to 11. 11 equals 11 is true, which verifies x equals 8 is the correct solution. For the second equation, again, the first step is to simplify both sides of the equation. We have two y terms on the left and two constant terms on the right. 5y minus 4y is equal to 1y or y. The left side simplifies to y minus 6 equals on the right side. Negative 9 minus 10 is equal to negative 19. And now again, to solve for y, we need to isolate y on one side of the equation, which means we need to undo the minus 6 by performing the opposite operation to both sides of the equation. To undo the minus 6, we now add 6 to both sides of the equation. Simplifying on the left, we have y, and then negative 6 plus 6 is 0 which is why we added 6 to both sides, giving us y equals, on the right side, negative 19 plus 6 is equal to negative 13. The solution to the equation is y equals negative 13. Again, let's go ahead and verify this by substituting negative 13 for y back into the original equation. Substituting negative 13 for y gives us 5 times negative 13 minus 6 minus 4 times negative 13 equals negative 9 minus 10. And again, let's go ahead and evaluate the left side on the calculator. The left side is 5 times negative 13 minus 6 minus 4 times negative 13. Which simplifies to negative 19 on the right side, negative 9 minus 10 is also negative 19. Negative 19 equals negative 19 is true, verifying the solution y equals negative 13 is correct. I hope you found this helpful.